stop returning any from your options. You can basically use generics instead. Generics uh, basically would let you write reusable and type safe code. Plus, they offer you good flexibility with your functions. We basically have them in functions. We use them in functions to infer types from when the function is called. Whatever the function is called with, that type is inferred inside the function. If we look at the code here, uh, we have this identity function, right? So it is the, as mentioned in the documentation, so TypeScript, identity functions are the hello world or hello world code for understanding generics. Uh, the structure of this is we have this generic type here, variable, t, and then the parameter of this function is typed of that t as well, and then the function returns the type of this t. What this capital T is, it is a generic variable. It could be anything. We can just have it written with any name or anything. But the idea is uh, this is a generic and it will hold the value with whatever the function is called with. That is the basic idea. I, the, 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 use, the use of this is because we can build uh, a function to handle a lot of different varieties of types rather than just having a single type, a concrete type. We would avoid duplication of code and uh, you know, basically just have one function in this identity function. When we pass in a string here, you can actually see the output that we get is string. Uh, internally, this works with the help of intelligence. Let's look at a good function here, which is use debounce value. This basic function takes in a value and returns that value after a certain delay that we can provide. So we have this generic variable here. The value is typed of that generic variable and we have a default delay which we can also pass in, but uh, it's rendered MS uh, on default. This function returns a promise of that generic type. The reason we return a promise is we'll have to await this function so that we have that delay, right? A simple structure, we return a promise and then we resolve it with the set timer of that delay, right? Just a general uh, debounce function. When we call this, we pass in a string and then we chain it so that we can uh, resolve that promise. Once that promise is resolved, we get this value. And if you see, this value is of type string because we passed in a number. Uh, oh, sorry, we passed in a string. If this was number, we would be expecting a number. Right? This helps us pass in any type. So hope this helps. Hope you get a understanding of this and uh, follow for more TypeScript tips. Thank you.